I'm. Yeah. I'm. I'm. I am in the stream. Oh. Let me just. And hello. then we got hello, that too. Hello. I can tell. I can hear you guys. Yeah. I got levels. I'm. I'm. I am. Okay. You cool. got layers like an ogre. Nope. I got yeah, level. I <clears throat> okay. So as you guys have been DM'd, I have a list of things. Um, I think the one that we said we were going to look at first for our hunt today was the was um, something wind. Let me see what it was. Cleaving wind, I think. Is it cleaving wind that we have? Rending. Rending wind. Mm, let me see. Or reaving. Reaving wind, I think. Reaving wind. Okay. Reaving wind. Let's see where we find these, and then we're going to try to find it. Also, if you happen to be watching today, thank you so much for watching. In fact, here's a wave and everything. Wave. Hi. Thank you very much for coming by. Ew. And today we are hunting for some of the most ridiculous things. So I don't even know what these things actually look like. Ah, uh, not those things. Jeez. Okay. Well, we have our work cut out for us, and this character's and this is like a level 83 thing that we have to try to find. So, I guess let us get on with it. Going to go out the door and head to Zarkabard! So, you two, how are your Saturdays going? Mm, pretty peaceful at the moment. It'd be a shame if something ruined that. It would be. Mine was. Mine I would was not be surprised. <laughs> what you mean was? <laughs> Did something upgrade? <laughs> yeah. We 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 all just saw that. Oh, was that the was that the upgrade that you were hoping not to get today? Did they slide up in your? That seat? was that like, that was that was the T, that I have predicted. Several times before, and oh. I should not be right every time. What? I mean, well, I mean, if you order the tea, it shows up. Don't put in your mailing address next time. <clears throat> I can't help it if tea drives past me and I'm like, oh, that's going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's, no. It's, it's literally, it's literally like a truck driving straight into me. Well, up, here it comes. Well, I mean, you know, I'm just saying you may want to consider... Just, just as a thought, right? As a, just a small thought, a minor one. You may want to suggest um, deactivating your location services so that every time you put out a signal, it doesn't find you. Like, wh why? And also, why are you outside looking for tea trucks? If you look for tea I wasn't looking for tea trucks. I was looking for tea trees. You know, a <laughs> thing, a thing with which to burn a flame. Oh, really? Did you not decide to check the RP channel earlier today? That's all I wanted from today. That's it. <laughs> That's all I wanted today. But just because, just because I happened to happen to see that goddamn Google car drive by me one day, <laughs> and, and 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 I pointed at that goddamn camera and said, "I'm about to see you, aren't I?" <laughs> and then. And then, not a month later, I look at I look at the go at, at the Google satellite feed of my location. There the fuck I am, pointing at myself. And you're just like, this is and this is <laughs> and this is why you don't go outside. This is why and you don't go outside. That is why I, I stay go inside, inside on uh, my laptop. Yep, this is why you stay inside. You don't go outside, boo, because that's how this happens to you. Lord, <laughs> have. <laughs> Have mercy on my soul. But I mean, that should make for interesting stabbing adventures a little bit later. <laughs> oh my god. Stab, stab, I'll be stab, right back. Stab. Someone's stab. calling my name. Huh? Here's Someone's like, calling my name. I'll be back. Here's like, I feel it. <laughs> uh, I, I'm pretty sure he feels attacked. Quite possibly. 
You're just like, he's not the only one who feels that. <laughs> Why is this a thing that you're doing? Okay, the thing I need to fight for that particular spell is up here. So we're gonna, you see that thing up there? Hmm. Here we go. Why are all the E-Tech weapons in this game ultra rares, but like, some of them just aren't even good. <laughs> oh, I do not have time for this have... right now. Hmm, what do you not have time for? like fighting this dragon and some other monsters decided to just walk up and try me today and I don't have time for that. You were saying. Uh, just, I hate how Morrowlands 2, there's a loot system, blah 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 blah. It's your standard like Diablo rank system where you got your blues, yellows, legendaries, except there's more ranks in Borderlands. Mm -hmm. That being said, so there are these ultra rare, ultra rares are purple, or dark purple. Dark purple signifies that there are these special weapons called E-Tech weapons. And they cost more ammo to use, but they're like, supposed to be really powerful, but like, some of them are just downright terrible guns. <laughs> Especially the shotgun versions. The pistols and the shotguns tend to just not be that good. Snipers, rocket launchers, some assault rifles, and SMGs are great E-Tech weapons that I normally have in my kit once I'm high level, but... Okay... So, I need to restart the game so the boss will spawn. And then it's farming time. Farming time. <laughs> farming Simulator 2017, am I right? You are certainly not wrong. It is similar to what I'm Here. doing in that it involves farming. I am farming for a particular weapon of sorts. Spell weapon. Is it a weapon or is it a spell? Um. So, what's happening here is I am trying to find a. I am trying to find a particular skill, but to do that, I have to fight this particular dragon that only appears here every so often. So now I'm just going to spend a whole bunch of time, kind of waiting for it until it appears. Because they're pretty rare, and they're also, like, really high up in the air. So you have to be looking for them or notice... You have to either be looking up to see them, or you have to kind of step into a spot right under them. And they have a shadow uh -huh. that, if you're not paying attention when you're running, is really hard to notice. Uh -huh. Also, welcome back, Nins. Oh, Hello so there, Rack. Yep. Hello. Kia ora. You're being greeted by tired Maori people. Hi. <laughs> I mean, except when it comes to stabbing. No one's ever too tired to stab. There he is! There he is! I have to try to fight him again! Okay, let's see if we can do this. He just appeared. He just appeared and he took off into the air, and now I have to find him. Where'd you go?
into the deep blue sea, sea, sea. To see what he could see, see, see. <laughs> nope. I am not involved here. I will have none of these shenanigans. Hello there, Claire B. Do. Thank you for being here. Um, Mr. Rex, things are going okay, so... Today's adventure is me trying to find monsters to get abilities from, and one of them just spawned, but then he disappeared. I don't know where he is. And this is why I'm dumb. I really could just check the map. Let's see what we got going on here. Oh, for crying out loud, you're not helping. Alright. <laughs> I forgot I had a legendary grenade mod. You know, what's really um, interesting is um, I have a weapon skill that starts with that R. P.S. If any of you lovely people in chat today happen to play Final Fantasy XI, and I don't know if you do, I'm currently on Odin. That might change, but I'm on Odin right now. Um, also, I want to point out for everyone that today's stream, in particular, is going to be a multi-part stream. So, you'll want to stick around for some things, but there will be a couple of breaks so I can do things like change titles and stop the video on demand from recording and all of this. So, the other games that I'm going to be playing today are going to be a surprise. There he is! Okay, let's see if we can get the ability to this time. Hello, Mr. Dragon. And I'm going past you, because I don't want to fight you over there. Nope, and you can't hit me. Because I'm like level 100 million and 5 compared to you. So I'm just going to run away. Running, 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 running. If you guys don't know the level I'm on versus this dragon, I could be, I could breathe on him and he might die. Um, one... He's clearly having a hard time hitting me. If he does, it'll probably do minimal damage. But two, I'm fighting him with a plastic sword and a bell. I'm not worried about him. Now, the thing that we're trying to get from him is Reaving Wind. So we're going to see if I can fight him enough and make him angry so that he'll do that thing that I'm trying to get him to do. Let's hope it works. Although, um, for Rex, just so you know, trying to collect this magic for blue mages can be kind of um, salt-inducing, to be fair. Huh? Because some of these things only come from boss battles, and so you would get into a boss battle and then not get the actual ability you're trying to look for. Here it is! Here's the ability! Okay, let's take a video clip! Yes! Uh.
that item right there is the R in RIP. Oh, he took all my TP, ho. So rude. All right, I have learned the thing. Okay, since Ninbin's picked the first one, Claire, you get to pick the second one. Oh, uh, let me look at that list real quickly. Um, also, people ah. in the audience, if you happen to want to know what I'm trying to learn, let me know and I'll try to put it up somewhere so that you can see it and then you can pick which abilities oh. I'm going to work on. That's a classic. Let's find Thunderbolt. Oh, you did. Okay, listen, that's a classic in some games. Not necessarily this one, but let's see if we can find it. I bet I have to learn it from a freaking I mean, it's curl. Not, it may not be a classic in that game, but like... Ooh, what is this? It's, it's, uh... it's a classic in a lot of the games that I play, so... Like, Thunderbolt's even a thing in Borderlands. Like... <laughs> There is a grenade mod where you just throw a thunderbolt, and I fucking love it. Uh, no spawning. That's cool. Loot for ammunition, money. Let us go back to Sanctuary so I can put on my Firestorm Grenade mod that I left in the vault. Okay, so I'm not fighting over, so I do not need trust. This damage. goes to Roland Berry, and I think Upper goes out to Saramugu. So we're gonna go ahead up and see some Waptas. We're gonna see some Dwagons. Wow. Some Dwagons. Wow. <laughs> hey, Mr. Nimbin, you okay over there? Do I need to tuck you in? Yeah. Nope. I'm just... Writing. Oh, this is Battalia Downs. I lied. Um... Sarumugu Champagne is Well, it is certainly not here wherever it happens to be, so I will not be going this way. I need to find a place with raptors, because that is where you learn this particular move I'm trying to learn. I'm um, also, for everyone listening to the stream, are you guys able to hear the game music okay? Should I turn that up a little bit, or what you got What you got for me over there? Do let me know, because I'm reading the screen. Well, for the most part, anyway. Mm. You know what I, mm. I just realized is like the biggest military flaw in Borderlands 2? Mmm. Oh no. Oh no. Oh man. They're, they're sh the, the shield generators to Sanctuary are outside the gate. Oh, that's... I 
I've never had this happen to me. Before. Okay, so allow me to increase cool. the volume of music in the game so that everyone might enjoy. I'm wondering going to turn that up too. I just got an achievement in Borderlands. That's really cool. I never knew that could actually happen. You'd be I surprised at what can happen when you. More often. I guess that's what happens when you even with people who can even. Oh, what? Yeah, like, I, I just came into town. I talked to a random. Uh, a, a random NPC, and he's like, hey, I found this gun out in the, in the Borderlands. I thought you would like to have it. And he pulled out a blue gun for me. I'm like, that's actually really cool. It's not a gun I'm going to be using, but that's really cool. Nifty. Also, um, Mr. Nimbin's what you're working on right now. Uh, I am working on the Shaman Homebrew class for 5e. You're making a homebrew class for 5e? That's gonna be... Indeed. Our sixth homebrew class? Why? Yep, I got permission. I got permission uh, because I wanted to play a shaman. I wanted to play a class that was broke, and, so I got permission to nothing... do it. Well, actually, I, I, there was nothing out there that wasn't broke. So I decided to just make my own. And I got permission to do that so that I can play so that um, uh, Mr. Mr. Crowman can be that and have a little more than shame on his side. I suppose that's true. That being said, it has to be nice to be able to play a game where the DM can just say, yeah, you can do that and no one challenges it. That has to be great. That has to be wonderful. Couldn't imagine. Because I know, I, yeah, I know I haven't, you know, had been, I haven't, I know I haven't been able to go through a campaign without someone arguing with me. Could not imagine. One day, one day, I'll know what that feeling is like, and I will be able to enjoy it. You know, Mr. Shaw, there's an ad here. For UNICEF, where um, <laughs> um, we're in the uh, the main the the main character of the advert is a young girl of some ethnicity, uh, while uh, waiting. Waiting at the stoop of her house for someone to get home, uh, and basically the ad goes through guilting everyone about about the lives they get to lead while this little girl waits. Um, and basically, you feel the, like they the, you got attacked. No, I'm at, like I I was the little girl. <laughs> <laughs> and I wait. <laughs> hey, Claire. Um, not you. Uh, the other one. Um, Miss Claire, we do. Let me know if you can hear that, okay? And then we'll go from there. <laughs> I am also going to. Also, it's 2017. When can't a man, you know, identify as as a as a young girl? When it's not accurate, I guess, would be one of them. That's fair. And it's lucky in my case that it's quite accurate. F9. Oh, okay. Like Over here by the save point. All right. So first thing, um, because it's a thing that I can actually do when I need help in the game, I'm going to summon imaginary friends. Wonderful. I do that all the time. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Look at all these people look at all these people being present and consistent when I need them. It's so great. <laughs> I'm 
gonna die. <laughs> like I just, I just call upon them, and they are there, and they give me no reasons that they cannot be there, and it is, and it is just perfect in every, in every conceivable way. Um, and it'd be great. And it'd be great if you could DM for them. Huh? <laughs> It would be great if you could DM for them. At least they'd be there. <laughs> I mean, it. I mean, it absolutely would be because if I say here's an adventure, they're just like, hey. Even if sure there's though. Oh wait, actually, here's the shade though. You actually have some of these creatures. Just like, do we really have to be do, like be this? I'm trying not to be here right now. And they will appear. Sorry. And they will appear. Anyway, even if they are, even if the first thing they do is give you a snide remark about how they'd rather be doing something else, <laughs> and the little girl waits. <laughs> so um, a little bit of story time. Just a, a small tidbit about myself. Okay, actually, before you get started with that small little tidbit about yourself, allow me to point out, if you're here on this stream right now, you came here for the shade. Although, that being said, the blue spell hunting part is actually kind of fun. You're here for the shade. Trust me on this one. Please continue. <laughs> it's so good. So, when I was younger, I used to play chess with myself. <laughs> I had a a special version of chess where there were four players instead of two, and I would just oh play Lord. that by myself. <laughs> oh, so Lord. you didn't just play chess; you played chess for four people, but you did that by yourself. You, you know something, Claire? You, I guess that I guess two things on that one. Number one, um, I can see now um, how why it is somewhat easy for you and for some other people to be able to play multiple characters like play themselves as multiple characters with different wants needs and opinions and feelings and all of that in a D, &D campaign so um mm. kudos to you. so kudos to you also um at the same time let us discuss and let us talk about um the need for that for a moment Hold on. I really need to be going in this direction. You mean the need the, for mean imagination? The well, need to be able to or play more than just yourself in a D and D campaign. <laughs> um now, see, the thing is, I didn't catch that shade, and I probably am glad that I didn't, because I'd be tempted to repeat it, and then that would cause problems. Now the other thing is, um have you ever thought about just running a D and D campaign with yourself? It seems like you have enough players for that. <laughs> yeah, look, they're right there on the screen. Not quite. I was, I was, I was, I was the, I was myself and three other people. I think I need one more. <laughs> oh, okay. you know, you know what's hilarious though? The actual first D and D, the, the actual first campaign I ever DM'd was only with myself. Oh. Oh. We normally could call that writing, then. One of my yeah, first sessions that I DM'd. <laughs> one of the first sessions I ever DM'd. Don't come over um, here, Tree. Leave me alone. Not, not the very first, but one of them. I literally just DM'd for two people. So did Sean. <laughs> oh. Not that I'm worried about it, but okay. So. You know what the funny part is? Is is the people that I those two people that I DM for, because they were the two most consistent people in my life at that moment in time. <laughs> How not so much anymore. Wait, someone join? Someone can't join. No, that was um, no. that was just me saying. Know what that's like? <laughs> Do you know? Oh. Do you truly know? I do. So, um, Brulio and time. Silver was, oh, really? at, at one point in time, were the most consistent people in my life.
you know, that's why Gorgia is redeemable to me. Because he does things like that. I'm like, can't I just be angry at you? God damn it, man. creature not to be stingy and use that thunderbolt move I came here for.
feel like we should be discussing something. Any topics anybody's found interesting as of lately? That isn't tea really. The lack of me of, of meter really? in song. Any topics anybody's found interesting as of lately? No. That isn't. I mean, I've just I, been listening to a lot of indie music lately, and a lot of it has no meter whatsoever. And judging from your tone of voice, you you don't actually don't come like for that me. all too much. <laughs> I like, in Every, my own opinion, a song can't be like Abba. No. But everyone can have rhythm. Okay, so... Well, actually, here. no, they can't, but they should. Actually, I know exactly what we should talk about today. So, dear viewers of the stream, all three of you, or however many there are of you that are here, tonight, there is a campaign, and in the campaign tonight... Oh, Lord. Um, I am a rogue, and uh, Claire... What, um... Classes for eight. What class might you be? Uh, actually, what class am I in this campaign? I forgot. Can you give us some um, clarity about what class you are? Oh. I will give you that information once I remember and or find it because I actually hey, wait, what I'm there. You're looking for a mind and forging. Yeah. I might have left that game. I'm Oh my god. Like, oh, like literally no tea, no shade, but I may have thought it was a different campaign. Let's see. I, I might feel like an asshole. Rippity dippity doo da. And or, I might not. Rippity doo da. Let us see. I feel like I was... Warlock? Also, the world was... Here is a team. Okay, da 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 Frey wasn't... Oh, wasn't I a sorcerer? I'm not sure. All I know is that you have a net. You were a sorcerer! Yeah, I was a sorcerer. A, 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 a favored one sorcerer. Yep. I should probably check to see if I'm still on the canvas. I still oh. love how stupidly Shady. useful that net is. <laughs> stupidly useful. <laughs> like, it, it actually put in quite a lot of work. Yeah, like, you're just, it's like, why did you use a net? I'm like, poof. That's a watch. <laughs> Watch me catch a friend. <laughs> catch a friend. What are those? <laughs> <laughs> I did leave the campaign. Oh, alright. Can you fix that, please, Madam Claire? I can't. I'm not a DM. <laughs> I have to bow and kowtow. No, what an ignominy this is. Oh no. Oh no, what an ignominious fate I have that has befallen me. Isn't he at work? I do believe so. Ah! That means, um... Ninja will literally be an hour and like five minutes late. <laughs> oh, oh, Michael streaming. Um, excuse me, sir. Don't do the thing. Don't do the thing. I see you. Don't do the thing. I'm. I. I have you both on two separate screens. Okay. I just need loyalties to be where they should be. <laughs> there we go. 
go, go. He asked me for an ace arrow, I'm just, I'm just go, I'm going to request an L. <laughs> Oh, uh, I should not S R here. Thank you for not S R. But... It doesn't help that he's playing Chance the Rapper either. God, that's some great music. Oh, and he turned it up, the bastard. If you happen to... Okay, so if you happen to like Mulan, you should listen to Claire do the rest of this karaoke, and if you happen to want to know who's cooler than me, you should ask him. No one's cooler than Sean. Don't, don't listen of... to me sing, I'm a terrible singer. Um, also, it's the only reason why he says no one's cooler than me is because my blanket happens to be upstairs. <laughs> I don't see what that has to do with you being cool. The puns. Oh, the puns. How dare you miss a well-placed pun, sir? I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Um, I, I, you know, I'm not, I'm not actually going to... Excuse that. Oh. And by excuse that, I mean I'm not going to offer an excuse. Because you don't deserve an excuse, Mr. Sean. Well, thanks to my wonderful command of the English language, I understood the thing that you intended to say, and I appreciate that. Thank you. I also just swallowed coffee down the wrong hole again. Um, did you... which one did you use? Um, hello? The one in my heart. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I am so mad. <laughs> um, I was coughing during that during that laugh, and it made it worse. What have we learned? <laughs> Don't laugh and sip sip at the same time. Don't laugh in Johan. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, I'm gonna kill over laughing, and oh, that like. Be the best death of my life. Nothing wrong with a little bit of that. Nothing wrong with that at all. Like, I, I either want to die old, sleeping, or laughing. I never want to die on the toilet. Never ever. But, you know... Considering considering divine comedy, that would be hilarious. Divine comedy be considered, it would really be during a mundane task. <laughs> <laughs> it would be while I was writing. <laughs> like you would smack your, you would you know it would be the end of a D and D campaign. You would con you know smack yourself so hard it would concuss you and send you into. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Be like, this just in, didn't mean to be a shady bitch, but that just gotta happen, I'm sorry. <laughs> um. I, I almost just coughed on my coffee again. What had you sufficiently amused to have that occur? Um, you made a, you made a, a hilarious joke. Well, I do try, so I thank you. Ah. Uh.
<sighs> hmm. Okay, let's have a little close up here. I think I should lock style. <laughs> Oh, chance, that was a lot of profanity. That was... I'm gonna be a little swashbuckling... A large. I'm just gonna be a little swashbuckling pirate in fancy clothes. Buckle them swashes! What you want, woman? <laughs> I Have you got no, both I probably shouldn't on stream. <laughs> you feel what? I said, I feel like I could tell you some shit, but like, I probably shouldn't say it on stream. But you can type it in the ocean. <laughs> In a bottle. I'm a genie in a bottle, baby. Oh no, we will not. Bam! <laughs> we will absolutely not do that. Oh no. Okay. Um, also, for everyone who is here, a couple of weeks ago, I did a run through good old classic Sonic the Hedgehog 2. I just decided to just power through as much as I could, and we managed to successfully um, finish the game, but my sound wasn't set up correctly, and so it sounded terrible because everybody could only kind of hear the whining music through my headphones. I fixed that earlier, so guess what that means for everybody? That means everybody can watch me do it again. In slow motion. <laughs> in slow mo. If, and, if anyone happens to be interested. Uh, I don't want to play Mario. Yes. <laughs> So, Sean, you're going to have to be a little bit of a meteor for me, but I'm going to ask your audience a question. Is anybody in your audience interested in the Rooster Teeth show Ruby? Okay, um, two things. One, hey, audience, um, my lady here has asked a question. For those of you who happen to know who Rooster Teeth is, do any of you Rooster happen Teeth. to enjoy Ruby? Also... Um, there is a large crystal at the end of this hallway, and it made me think of a D&D &D campaign that I'm playing. So I'm just going to leave this here so that Ninbins can look at it later and determine if this is what's under the land that we're on right now. Basically. That is basically what is what is keeping um, the, the Wayfarer's Island afloat.
Also, I hope I hope you you other two DMs are keeping notes of the the law that I'm sharing. Mm-hmm. What do you mean, other two DMs? Well, the point the 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 point of um, Cloudsy was was to allow a collaborative project wherein we could all DM from at some point or another. Unless you just want to rotate the people who are DMing. No. For tea and for shade. Speaking of which, my cup is empty. So is mine. I I need to go to the restroom. I'm assuming you're not taking the stream with you on this. No. Alas, alas, that would be unsanitary. And I would I would hate to lower the quality of your stream to shitty. <laughs> <laughs> and or and or piss poor. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> mm -mm. Nope. <laughs> I will be no part of that. None. I will be no part of it. <laughs> Are you responsible for this, Claire? Are you responsible for this? I mean, it's it's it's, it's bad puns or shade at this point. <laughs> I am responsible for bad puns. <laughs> I love them though. I love them so much. Shade is now bad puns are forever. No, shade and puns are forever. I thought T was forever. <laughs> T is forever, Shade is now. Huh? All three of those things are forever. I I live on T. The shade the shade keeps me cool and and puns make me laugh. Okay. I think I've given up trying to farm for the Infinity Pistol. I'm just going to try and continue with the weapons I have. I'll have. Oh no, I remember the Infinity Weapons. They have the double, the double barrels, right? That that make the Infinity symbol. Yep. They have uh, double barrels, infinite ammo, never reload. <sighs> but also piss poor damage, isn't it? I mean, what it lacks in damage, it makes up in fire rate, usually. That's fair. Alright, I'll be back.
Welcome back, Sean. I didn't go anywhere. Oh, well. Just I figured that you had gone to refill your tea and were AFK. <laughs> I, I, would, I would love to do that. I don't know if we have any more at the house. Oh, rip. I might need something stronger than tea. Also, rip. I don't know, maybe I should order donuts. <laughs> sounds really good, actually. They're made with cake batter instead of normal dough. <gasps> huh. um, if you go to orderbulldogfood.com, um, it's on there. Um, it's on there. It's called um, Zombie Donuts. Wow, that sounds... Amazing. One of my friends were sitting here in um hanging out and watching a movie and I was like, Hey, do you want to go get some do like get some donuts? And they was like, Where? And I'm like, Zombie Donuts and they we're really excited about it, and it's kind of like, well, I mean, I guess I could go get the car before we go watch the movie, and I'm like, well, we could order and just have them delivered here, and the look on their face was priceless. They were just like, um, yeah. <laughs> also, um, Litany, there is such a thing as Twitch channel abuse. I'm gonna need you to stop slapping the channel, please. Who is slapping your channel? What? Um, one of the guys over here in chat, um, Mr. Litany, slapping the channel. How rude. Oh, hippogriffs. Ew. Ew, ew, ew. I don't like them. Do you just not like them in general, or do you not like them in that game? Since you did what? Since you've been gone... Welcome back, now. Oh, Kairi! I'm- I'm at a loss for words. 
Like oh. you, you two, you two reply. You, you two, you two said welcome back in two different languages. Like I just was like, Kauda. <laughs> Yeah, the proper response here would be, "Hey." Well, that's basically counter means hello, or at least that's how it's how it's um used. I had those followers before you slap the channel, you jerk. Stop. Also, hello, Mr. Mark. I believe that's you. I could be wrong. Don't you know you're not supposed to call real names of people on the internet? Because the internet has no way of knowing who you are if you don't say your real name in streams. Um, fuck the police. Um, Mr. Nins, you have gotten a reply hello. I know, I saw. I came! I saw! You had more teeth. No, I had acid reflux. <laughs> but also... Yes? A, a ph philosophical question here. For whom? <clears throat> uh, do you believe in divine design? Intelligent design? Or evolution. Yes. <laughs> Be best answer yet. Like neither of these, and you know, it's classic conversations here for some, right? But on a, I don't think. Like you know, when you're talking about things like evolution, if we're going to have that, right? We need to talk about the different divisions they're in. There are only really two, right? You have either like macro, macro, and micro. Um, mm -hmm. So in between. Hey, we like game playing league. <laughs> let's not. Um, so like game playing league, in which I might win the game if I'm a decent support. <laughs> AKA, I'm usually paired up with someone playing Zaya. So, um, what we have here, if you were to ask me, right, and you're asking me right now, is the idea that we don't have these large scale changes wherein, hey, you know, I used to be a snake, but now I'm a dragon bird? <laughs> um, is likely not a, is likely not a thing and I don't think that's supported by you know by science for the most part anyway but the idea of small adaptive changes over time that given a long enough time period make significantly large changes where if you were to look at where things started and where things ended might be different very possible and those are things that you can currently of like that you can currently observe um, in pretty much any species alive still. So I think that is very much a thing. Do I think that was um, a function of divine design? Well, considering that I believe God to be um, a person who has like an, an intellect and a will and goes like I have thoughts about a thing that I am doing and I am doing the thing then I then those are basically going to be the same um, for me so there's that too you know that being said if I build something to perform a function and you know you know if or actually it would be a lot like um, I guess the easiest way to explain it would be to program um, AI, because it's a thing that we can currently do. If I program something to learn from its surroundings and responses that it gets to its environment and adapt accordingly and it does those things, does that mean it wasn't intelligently designed? Well, question mark? Oh, wow. Claire's response. Why would you ask him a question like that? Um... 
He's doing it for the vine, Claire. That's that's why. He's doing it for the vine. Well, I asked I, I asked that question because I knew I'd get, you know, at least an explanation. Huh. Well, um, well, Victor, um, are you satisfied with that response? Has that been capture, um, has that been captured for your records? <laughs> I am confused. <laughs> Do you have any questions about what I've said, Victor? No. Um. Um. You guys I, don't know who this like, Victor. It was kind of. Oh, it was kind of rude. a trick question. <clears throat> Only a trick question for some, I imagine. Well, the the answer is either yes or intelligent design. Are those your... Well, ultimately speaking, I'm guessing following the path that I have there, it probably would be. Exactly. Um... What, and, and even, even on... Like, a, a, a... Even on the smallest scale possible. Human... Human existence... Has changed the way that things have... That, that things like plants and whatnot have evolved. Oh no, oh no, I did the thing where I opened the box, but I didn't get what was in the box, I have to do that again. It can be argued that that is not particularly an intelligent design, but by, by, by the nature of, of selection um, of the fittest, okay, that's... that is how we have I am influence. To... I'm going to have to challenge yeah, you on sense. that whole thing on survival of the fittest and such, because listen, no selection of the fittest, Mr. Sean. Well, I think there was um, what is it? Um, there was a selection thing, and I can't remember the full name of it. It was something selection, but I can't think of what it was. Um, Natural selection. Thank you. Um, I don't know. Considering the post that I've seen on Twitter or. On Incredible source. No, I, I'm talking about natural selection no, in regards in, in, in regards to, 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 to human influence. Hey, you're being engaged in chat at the moment, Mr. Dinbin, so have yeah, fun I can with see. that. Now with that being said, I want to hold on. Why does this game look so much smoother when I'm not actually on the window? Oh, that is rude. Actually, I may have a, I'm like, I probably have credible sources. Hold on for a moment. I'm at. Hold on. I am legitimately mad about this. I'm getting better frames and animations than anything when I'm not actually focused on the gaming window. So I'm legit just gonna start fighting things and then walking away from the wind and then like tapping out of the window so everyone can watch it. This is so stupid. But wait a minute. I wonder if the stream is recording what's happening in that window. <clears throat> oh, yeah, see, that thing looks butter smooth. I'm so upset. I, I literally cannot I literally cannot post my my credible source here. Why not? Cuz Nightbot is mean. <laughs> well, um I here I will let you um I'm going to say the sensible thing, which would be, hey, for those of you who happen to be paying attention to Nightbot and whatnot, right? There happens to be a um well, I mean, the you know, it's probably been written, but the documentation's in a beta version. Um, also, post it in Discord if you want to, like, post it in Discord and potpourri. Oh, that's that fair. Can read that's that. fair. Yeah. And then... Potpourri! In case anybody was wondering what the name of that channel was, it is Potpourri. Potpourri! 
I'm not pronouncing it as French as it could be pronounced, so there's that too. Oh, oh hail August, ruiner of the skill chain. Huh? Said all hail August. It's the name of a character I'm in game with right now. His name is August. You know, I find this surprising and also very relieving that you guys didn't ask me that question. <laughs> I mean, that was a general question today. Basically, Claire, don't point out that we didn't ask you a question that you don't want to be asked. That's fair. That is very fair. Yeah, don't be like me and stare at the Google camera. While you're standing <laughs> outside in your Super Mario Pizza shirt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so is, um, by the way, for those of you who are aware of the Steam sale happening right now, are there any games on there that you think, or that you're looking forward to buying for yourself, or that you think I should buy and play on stream? Borderlands 2, what? <laughs> Claire. Is that, a, is that a serious statement? I mean, it's semi-serious. You know how I am about this commitment thing. I know. I'm not sure you actually want to commit the time to a game that requires so much farming and time. Which is why I'm only semi-serious. <laughs> Not to well, mention... I mean, that's what Nin said about Guild Wars 2, but I will tell you, just like I told him, you know, you just need to be straight up about it. If you want me to buy the game, you just say, hey, I want you to try the game and I will play with you. Because that's usually all I'm looking for. Oh, God. I, you know, like, between everything, I just haven't had the time to play myself. Let alone with anyone. That is The worst bad. thing about mosquitoes is that they triple attack. So if they triple attack, like it just it, it hurts. It's annoying. On the other hand, I get to like, you know, cut with the sword in Z formation. And I'm running away. I'm actually trying to think of a game that I think Sean would enjoy. Like, thoroughly enjoy that's on sale on the scene right now. Heal me, Goofy B. <laughs> I feel like, like, my, Sean, your biggest. I don't, I don't want to call it a niche, but your biggest category of games is MMOs. Well, from what I've actually, seen. well, you would think, right? But it's really not that I'm into MMOs. It's that I'm really into RPGs, and MMOs are just RPGs you can play with other people. Like, if you, you, you'd have to see the video games that I have here. If you want to know the ones that I like the most, RPGs and fighting games. But they don't really uh, make na those. name off name off some of your favorites. Um, some of my have. some of my favorite like RPGs that I've played or ones that I have on my shelf at the moment. Both. Okay. Um, things that I enjoy that I also have. Um, Final Fantasy X is one. Um, Tekken Five is another. Um, hold on for a moment while I move this stuff around, because it's also partly an anime collection, too. Um, there is a mega pack for Sonic up here. There is also, I have a couple of Shadow Hearts games, but I haven't played those. I have Shadow of the Colossus, too, but I haven't played either of those. Um, Genji is a lot of fun. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed the Dot Hack series as well. Such a great series. Um, if you ever find an emulator to play those on, Mr. Sean, please let me know. Um, I only have them for console, though. I don't have them on PC. 
but if I play them, I will be sure to let you know, so, um, so that you can enjoy that experience. Um, but there's a lot of, there's a ton of RPGs I'm just looking forward to playing for the first time. Um, but most Final Fantasy series, and why most Final Fantasy series, I do mean 5 and 6, 5, 6, Tactics, 9, 10, um, um and then 10, 2, um, 10, 2, because... Charlie's Angels plus like Sailor Moon. Right. Plus, right. Like, Charlie's like, Angels plus Sailor Moon. Um, I would just like um, hello. Yes, please bless me this day with these outfit changes. Yes. Yes, girl. Sing it. Um, no, <laughs> no, well, no. Like specifically, you know what that OP flower costume though? Hell yes. Okay. <laughs> You should yeah, you have to play you have to play ten first. Yeah. Um also uh, for for your information, Mark, I, I posted um musical evidence. You say musical <laughs> on on intelligent design? Okay, I would <laughs> Why? If you'll if you'll uh, if you'll address your view to the Popery channel. <laughs> um, PC. Oh, is that um is that an emulator for? Yeah, yeah, PCA okay. six two. Okay. You know. Oh my God, uh, rude! Why would you uh, do this? Maybe Borderlands isn't that far off of your MO after all. It probably isn't. I and the thing is, for everyone else's notes, I also I think... don't. I don't like F. I I have a thing with FPSs. I don't particularly like them unless I play with a whole team of people that I like, and it is really hard to do that. That's fair. Um, I just I have issues. Mark, are you and that was the one reason. Statement? I think that was Adam? the one reason why I didn't think it was a game for you is because it's an FPS and I don't see you play any FPS. Well, I don't play any FPSs on PC. I do my favorite FPS. <laughs> my favorite um, FPS. Um, to tell you, my favorite FPS game of all time is so far still Army of Two. Mm. I remember playing it's that. It's a fun co-op game, and yeah. it's and I liked it for that reason. Like you have a like you have me. Like it's a game where you only have one of two roles, and the role that I and the role that I get into. Is the one I enjoy the most. I just kind of I have a friend who's super aggressive, gets the shiny, glossy gun, and runs out and draws all the attention. That gets to sit back and fight people, and it's perfect because that's what I actually do. In fighting games, I prefer to be a person who kind of like calmly assesses situations and picks places to push strategic things like proximity mines and stuff, and does that. And you know. In FPSs, it's really hard for people to keep tempers in check, which I have a problem with. And people are kind of like hyper competitive. Like in League, I you know, League is competitive, but it's competitive in a way that I can follow and comprehend and understand. I can't understand this stuff that people get into with FPSs, where they're basically acting like that game pays their bills. Oh no, I can't. <laughs> oh, that's the nice thing about Borderlands is you're not actually going up against other people. Of course, there is a dual mechanic, but it's not your healer. Well, Heal it's, me, it's please. Like, it's, it's a party game in a way. Thank you. Here's here's my perspective on Overwatch, Mr. Sean. On Oversalt. Um, it's you call it, it Oversalt. It, it is it is more likely than any other if. Piece. Except for maybe lawbreakers right now. Lawbreakers has its own issues to deal with, um, but they're not necessarily gameplay ones. I think I think its largest issue is its small maps. 
considering how much mobility is is what's the word emphasized in that game there's not a lot of space to be mobile in. <clears throat> The thing about Additionally, that, you move pretty slow without your movement abilities. Now, the other thing I like about MMOs and why I enjoy playing them is you'll notice that there's a certain theme of a level of responsibility that you have as an individual to be good at the game, but then you have a community who it serves better in pretty much every case to help you rather than be a jerk, right? Because it's a community-oriented thing. If word gets around in the community that you're a jerk, no one wants to play this game with you. So that makes it harder for you to get things because there's a lot of content in the game that requires you to have other people to help you. Um, also, uh, I'm, I'm going to backtrack here a little bit because I didn't see um, Mark's reply there. Uh, it, it's not. It's not that the people who who designed it were un, whether they they were intelligent or not. It's the fact that the the thing was designed. Therein lies therein lies the intelligence. The fact that someone chose to change to change the the molecular and or genetic structure of the thing. Um, and back to, back to video games. Um, and, and back to the fact that basically my video games are basically the same thing as being a mental and emotional submarine for all the depth it has. Um, with that in mind, um, games I would, I don't mind, like, Nin and Troy are re are currently trying to talk me into playing Overwatch, and, you know, like, it was one of those, let me talk to you about me and games in general. I play Final Fantasy not because I chose it, but because a friend of mine was like, I really want you to play this game, and I have a very, I had a very specific thing for a very long time of not, like, buying tons of games. And so, I told them, well, tell you what, if you buy me the game to play with you, I promise to commit to playing the game with you. And it was on sale for $10. That is a fair point, Mr. Sean. And so that's how I, that's how, that's my policy on playing video games with people. If I find people that commit to playing the game, that like show serious like, commitment for playing the game with me, then I will try a game. I have like two or three games that, you know, people have showed me and it's like, hey, this is really cool. And my response is, hey, are you going to play that game with me if I get it? No, it's not really a game like that. Okay, and then I don't, and then I don't get the game. Like, a game has to, like, really interest me for me to get it if I can't play it with other people. And there aren't a lot of them. Like, the last one that I ran into that interested me enough to get it for myself without having to play it with other people was, um, actually Hollow Knight. Hollow Knight looks like such, such a great game. Ori, um, Ori also looks interesting. Uh, pardon me? Ori looks interesting, so I think I'll play that one too. Do I have my imaginary healer friend yet? No? Okay. <sighs> Triple attack mosquitoes. Yes! Let me tell you, they make weapon skills the most rewarding thing to do in this game because of the animations you get for it. Get these, like, pretty looking things. Oh, did I just open this box? I didn't know I could just open it. 
Ooh, this is grindy. But I'm still waiting for, like, magical healer friend. So, I guess I'll go back and fight the behemoth. Let's go fight the behemoth. Mm, I'm gonna have to figure out how to like get a day to myself during the week because I can't. Like, I just got. I realize I now have a D and D group for every single day of the weekend. I'm sorry. There is a Friday group, there is a Saturday group, and there is a Sunday group. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh. Welcome like, to D&D, Sean. <laughs> like, just thinking about it now makes my eyes hurt. Oh my god. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Scream your heart out, Mr. Sean. No one, no one can hear you in the, in the, in the abyss of D&D. You're, you are not lying. There are, there are no <laughs> lies to be, you are not lying at all. There are zero lies to be found in that state. Jesus. <laughs> You're like, no one can hear you. And I am like, they certainly cannot. I want the smooth looking graphics for when I'm not playing on stream. I'm so mad. I am still very upset about the smoothness of animations when I'm not focused on screen. I'm gonna be forever mad about that. Freaking G-Sync only working when I'm not focused on screen. This is upsetting. The game doesn't deserve to look that good when I'm not focused on stream. Okay, I'll stop complaining about it for two whole seconds. Actually, let me see if I can get the really nice people at the front gate to teleport me out there. Scree! Caw! Scree! Caw! Scree! Oh man, I have to, I have to uh, channel my inner fray tonight. It's this is gonna be interesting. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll try not to make that very hard for you. <laughs> you know something. You you know something. All things being considered, Claire, like for the way that my character and your character get along in this game, 
I should just, like, start mailing you, like, wedding plans now for, like, real-life events. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> I'll start with the computer. Ah, oh, goddammit. <laughs> and then I'll go, it has Overwatch installed on, a, like, a sticky note. Oh, actually, hold on for a moment. Uh huh. Because this is my favorite song, uh, one of my favorite songs in the game. And so you ahhing about the thing I think you're ahhing about? No, I'm eyeing at my phone. There were too many notifications there, and I couldn't handle them. And by notifications, I mean like... Text messages? <laughs> no, just, just likes on Facebook that, that have nothing to do with me. Your friend liked this. Maybe you would like it too. No! <laughs> okay, I need to focus. Oh, That's me in social media in general. That's me in social anything in general. Hey, do you want to? Mm -mm. Please stop asking me to go out. Please don't ask me to go out today. But no. Mm -hmm. But it's so nice outside. It really is. I can see that from inside because I have a window in front of me. How come you don't want to go outside? Because I don't like it out there. But why? Why? Scary. No, just like, why don't you like, why don't you want to go outside? It's a resource. <laughs> yep, my chill is gone. I'm sorry. I didn't stop you. Uh huh? I didn't stop you. Oh. My love. Wait, wait, what? Oh, it's Calling, 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 calling. Okay, so dramatic and ridiculous thing, but this game has a timeline that happens in an alternate time zone where you have to travel to the past and all that. And so there are certain means of travel that you can only access if you take this other portal that takes you back in time so that you can then use portals that you found back in time. Except for crystals. If you're using... Well, actually, crystals are demon books. It's, um, annoying. Hey, Mark, if you're still here, I forgot. I have a thing I need you to read. Why don't I want to go outside? What's the real reason? Since we're going to apparently have that conversation today. Um... He says he knows do why we all I really... Go, do we all want to go one at a time? <laughs> Wait, what are we talking about? Going outside. Um, no, I am not scared that it will rain salty tears. I'm probably scared that it'll start- that I'll be attacked by Spongebob at random. Kill him! There's a there's a story there about um, salty tears. Related to um, myself and you know I should just not be petty. I really should. I should just not be petty.
Um, alright, I have DM'd that to you, Mr. Mark. Okay, let's see where I am. I'm a little bit up the map from where I wanted to be. Scree. Caw. Scaw. <laughs> Hey, what are you doing tonight? Minding my business and leaving yours alone. That is the answer that I want to send um, via text message right now, but I am not going to do that. Oh. Do I feel a sense of dread? Because D and D is happening today. Uh, Am I gonna have to? Uh, oh. Okay. Let's see if I can run up here and go west. In a bottle, throw it into the sea. So annoying. Okay, so I'm basically gonna have to like cross the river to get to the other gate that I can then use to try to jump over a wall so that I can get to the other side of the man. I'm going to ride a giant bird. Why do people make my life? You're oddly timed you're oddly timed to this mountain flying song. <laughs> There's a song that the game plays when you're riding a mount. Did I miss my chance to cross upstream?
What's going on, Chan? Me trying to cross a river to get to the other side. You know, I don't think I want to ask another chicken why it crossed the road. It should just have the right to do whatever it wants. And before anyone in stream says it, especially Mark, I understand that I'm flying on a bird and that makes my statement incredibly ironic. Shut up. Okay, so I low-key want Mark to say something though, so I can make a reference to something. Mark. Mark. Absolutely not. That is unacceptable. That is unacceptable. You have no shame Please, spawn an enemy! None. Sir. Absolutely not. That is not how these things are done. I am literally flying on a bird but can't go over this wall. I want everyone to see this, like I have a bird that is required to hover off the ground. I would like everyone to see that it is multiple pixels where it could just fly over this wall, but no. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Wait, you said you were behaving. You're not behaving. I don't know what Claire said, so you can't really blame her for that. Oh, uh, other. Yep, other Claire. It's always other Claire.
I may have played this game a lot. I may know most of the musical score. I may feel absolutely no shame in admitting either of those things. You can't see me, I'm undetectable in this big contraption. Undetectable. You can't see me, Jack, hiding behind this machine. Yep. Trying to be hard. Alright, time for more imaginary friends! <laughs> I need a healer. This guy. This red mage. Probably this guest show. Okay. Yeah. You're asleep. <laughs> or muted. Huh? We were asking if you were. Well, she was asking if you were alive. <laughs> I live. I write. You were probably listening to sweet, sweet jams. I was watching a guy dance. Well, I mean, as the Barnabys commands. We'll just throw this guy in here for fun. Oh, I did not bring another source of attacks, so that means I'm gonna have to bring the full business. And that means I'm gonna have to fight with normal blades. But in skill gear. Let's see what I got here. Alright, let us do the thing. You can't actually hit me.
Dobby is a free elf indeed. Is it Dobby or Dobby? I always get hear people say it differently. Well, does it have one B? Dobby, or two? well, like it's it's you can tell what it is by the way that Adobe is spelled. Does it have, yeah, like I said, does it have one B or two? It's uh, Dobby is two Bs. How is it spelled in the book? It's spelled D O B B Y. Oh, okay. Well, then, yeah, you know, that's kind of how English works, so we can do that. Yeah. Well, I mean, if anyone if, if anyone decides to argue that point with you, you can just say there aren't two bees in Adobe. Well, <laughs> there also aren't two there also aren't two bees in robe, and we know how that word works. Exactly. Roby, what? <laughs> There's a rule for why Roby, in that particular Roby, case. Sponge Bobby, and you know, there you go. <laughs> Sponge I'm Bobby. sorry. I'm being really messy. Today. I am being really messy today, and I should not do the thing. Okay, so our our behemoth friend is being really mean and stingy with spells today. So do we want to pick a different spell on our list, or do we want to go with what's behind curtain B? Mm. I think that that should be left up to your audience for sure. What say you, audience? Do we continue? Do we continue looking for a different spell, or? Do we go with game B? I would say it's being left up to the audience, but the audience hasn't said anything yet, right so there. I'm going to add. I'm gonna poll the audience as well. Oh. Mark says I should. Mark says, "Hey, you should just just make a decision." So rude. So disrespectful. Okay. Then, what I'm going to do is, well, I guess the first thing being first, I'm going to pop back home. I'm gonna have to make sure to collect that very important imaginary friend at some point. So, I'm going to go ahead and do that, and then we're going to take a pause. So, stay here while I go and get what's behind curtain B, because as usual, all the hard decisions are left to me. Always. All the time. Shit. But seriously, don't go anywhere. Stick around. I will be back in just a moment. 